What's up, my sniper? It's a 76, and I'm East Superior. Welcome back to Undertale. Last time we left off, we were doing these puzzles from left to right. And now, let's save right here. Because we got all the keys. So now we are able to go through here. What? Wait, what is this? Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Oh. Seems to be turned off. Oh, so I can't even see these anymore. Oh, I think I know what's gonna happen. The power! Seems like this controller has power. Turn it on. Something's gonna happen. Oh. My. Christ. Stop! Hey, stop! Hey, Alphys! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They got they get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on, t on time. Um, anyway, the power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you. But I appreciate that you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back, but there's not... There's, it's, pfft, but that's not because of these guys or anything. I, I was just worried that I would be too afraid to tell the truth, that I might run away or do something. Cowardly. Um, I, I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I call determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. I have a theory about this. I feel like Asgore, when I think I died, I came back as a soul and reformed my body. And Alphys injected me with determination, but it failed. So I was tossed onto a flower bed Wait, no, that doesn't make sense, because I fell down in a hole. Okay, how about this? I fell down from the hole, and I died. The soul that was originally Tony came into the human soul that fell down. And now I, my name is Tony. And now I'm jet with determination from that soul that died off. I don't know. It's, it's just a theory. You see, unlike humans... Monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take these co concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to melt and lost their and lost what physically they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted together into those. Seems like seems seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much everyone was asking me, and I was too afraid to do any more work knowing everything I'd done so far has been such a horrible failure, horrific failure, but now, now, I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard, being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure that there will be times where I struggle. I'm not I'm sure they'll there there will be times where I screw up again but knowing deep down that I have friends to fall back on I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own thank you come on guys it's time for everyone to go home Wow that's kind of sad What? Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet be because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of the garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It approached just before the queen left. I wonder what happened when something without a soul gains the will to live. 
Entry number 18. The flower's gone. Is this flowey? Why did that slowly come up? It's a voice you have never heard before. Tony, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Tony, see you soon. What is happening? What? Wait, the door is jammed shut with vines. Um. I am so confused. So what now? Do I just fight Asgore again? Because Flowey sent me back to where I never fought Asgore. So what now? Why is there no save? There's no save. Okay, there's a save. Jesus. I guess I'm fighting Asgore. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance, you have any unfinished business, please, do what you must. Well, I can't go back, so I guess I have to continue. I see. This is it, then. Gotta hate this. Ready? Strange life fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination. Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. What? Already? Well, wait! What just happened? Toriel! What a miserable creature torturing such a poor innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel, your friend and guardian. At first, I thought I would let you make your own journey, your journey alone. But I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous. And ultimately, it would be it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You would have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I have been trying to prevent this whole time? So, for now, let us suspense this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier with after you got one soul. All this time, you could have just done it with one soul? Are you serious? I'm sorry, my throat is a little bit parched. I had a drink. Taking six souls from the humans, then come back and freed everyone peacefully? But instead, you made everyone's lives in despair. Because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Tori, you're right. I am a miserable creature. But, do you think we can at least be friends again? <sighs> no, Asgore. Yeah, Asgore! 
Human, never fight each other. Everyone's gone. Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll, I'll. Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah, nice to meet you. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? <laughs> Jeez, that's rough, buddy. Hey, Alphys! Hey, every nobody hurt each other. Oh, are you another friend? I am Toriel. Hello. Uh, hi. There's two of them. Hey, nobody fight anyone. If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. Hello. Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst. Hey, human. Did Asgore shave and clone himself? What? Hey guys, what's up? That voice. Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh, hey, I recognize your voice too. I'm Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans. And, uh, same. Oh, wait then. This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It is nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Oh, we. I cannot believe Asgore's clone knows who I am. You're not a clone, you stupid. This is the best day of my life. Hey, Papyrus. What does a skeleton tile his roof with? Um, snowproof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles his roof with. Shine shingles. I changed my mind. This is the worst day of my life. <laughs> Oh my god, yes. Oh, look at them. Come on, Asgore. It's gonna be okay. Oh, poor Asgore. He's crying! Oh, man. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about the fish thing. Sometimes you gotta go to, uh, stopping, stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, just go to the, just get to know a really cute fish. Oh, it's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analog. Oh my god! Will you two just smooch our- <laughs> Oh, Metaton, yes! Oh my, yes. The audience is dying for some romantic action. H hey, sh shut up! Man, the nerve of that guy. R right, Alphys. Uh, Alphys? No. He's right. Let's do it! <laughs> well, uh, I, I guess, if you want to then, don't hold back! Don't hold anything back! Wait! Not in front of the human. Why? No, I wanted to see! Uh, right. Sorry. I got a little carried away there. <laughs> wow. The whole gang is here. The only thing we're missing here now is, uh, what's his name? That little monster kid. I don't remember his name. I think that's what his name is actually, Monster Kid. My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. Looking at all the great friends you have made, I think, I think you will be happier here. Hey, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know how to call everyone? Let's just say, a tiny flower helped me. What? A t tiny flower? Oh no. What? No! You idiots! While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls! And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friend's souls are gonna be mine too! <laughs> and you know what the best part is? It's all your fault! It's all because you made them love you! 
all the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, you wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and humans together, I will achieve my real form. <laughs> huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you just within your reach and then tear it away just before you grasp it over and over and over <laughs> listen if you do defeat me I'll give you your happy ending I'll bring your friends back I'll destroy the barrier everyone will finally be satisfied but that won't happen you you'll keep I'll keep you here no matter what. Oh god. No. Even if it means killing you one million times! <laughs> this is just cruel. This is literally cruel. Uh. What? That was Toriel's attack. Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. Hey, that was Undyne and Papyrus' attack. That's right, human! You can win! Just do what I would do! Believe in you! Hey, human! If you got past me, you can do anything! You don't- so don't worry. We're here with you all the way. <laughs> You haven't beaten this guy yet. Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on you. Tutorials and... Alphys? Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him, but somehow, I know you can do it. Human. For the future of humans and monsters. You have to stay determined. Oh my god! Holy crap! Uh, no! Unbelievable! This can't be happening! You! You! Uh-oh. I can't believe you're all so stupid! All of your souls are mine! Oh my god. Oh, that was a monster kid. Whoa. Um. What? What? Who? Wait, who's this? Um. Hello? Finally. I was so tired of being a flower. What the heck? Oh. Howdy. Tony? Are you there? It's me. Your best friend. Whoa. Asriel. Dreamer. That was the little kid that died. It's the end. Let's dream. You think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory got it smaller and smaller. Oh shit. Wait, this is this is Toriel's attack. Oh my god, my head. You held on your hopes and you reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. Oh my god. This is so weird. Shit. Okay, epilepsy warning. Shocker breaker. Hope. 
you kept holding on, reducing damage. You know, I don't really care about destroying this world anymore. Oh my god. Whoa, what? But it refused. Oh, so I keep going. Okay. You hold on to your hopes. You reduce how much damage you'll take this turn. Damn it, I could have done nothing, but okay. You think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory getting smaller and smaller. Shit. Wow, this is so cool. You can keep holding on. Damage reduced. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to re reset everything. So beautiful. Keep holding on, reducing damage. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. Wow, that's hard. Wow, this is such a good battle. That we can do everything all over again. Bad memories. And you know what the best part of this is? You'll do it. Oh my god. That is so cool. And then, you'll lose to me again. Shit. My god. Pie. You ate the butterscotch pie. And again. We can do this. Okay, this time. Okay, come on. We can do this. My god, man. Keep holding on. Damage reduced. My god. Through determination, the dream became true. Because you want to ha a happy ending. Well, yeah, I want you to be friends with me, man. Come on. God, this music is beautiful. Because you love your friends. But yeah, I love you too as well. Shit. Because you never give up. What the frick? Okay, come on, we can do this. We're almost there. 
isn't that delicious? Your determination, the power that let you get this far, it's gonna be your downfall. God, that's powerful. Dream came true. Now, enough messing around. It's time to purge this timeline once and for all. Oh! That is so creepy. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way? Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Oh god, that's creepy. Oh my god, that's cool! <laughs> Alright. That's cool. I'm scared. I can't. I can't. All I can do is struggle. You can't move your body. <laughs> you hold my true power. Well, shit. <laughs> that was that quick. Can't move your body. You can feel it every time you die. Your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life will end here in a world where no one remembers you. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. The, atti the attitude will serve you well in the next fire. Back together. Meow, <laughs> meow. Still, come on, show me what your true determination is now. Oh my god, this thing. Come on. Ah! I'm gonna keep dying, isn't it? Can't move your body, nothing happened. You're sh you struggle, nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file. <coughs> Skip, excuse me. You tried to save your save file, nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file, nothing happened. Seeming, seems saving your game really isn't impossible. But, maybe. With what little power you have, you can save someone or something else. Save? Oh! You reached out to Azrael's soul and called out for your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's... The lost soul appeared. All humans will die. Oh yeah, I have to just freaking save them, though. Uh, recipe. You ask the lost soul to teach you how to cook. It doesn't seem, she doesn't know why, but she kind of wants to teach you how. You're our real enemy. Oh my god. Clash. You clash against the lost soul with all your might. She feels your fighting spirit. It's similar somehow. Mercy is for the weak. Yes, I will kill you. Fake hit. You tap the lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight. It's all flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. No. I didn't mean to do that. Papyrus. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something reason resonating. The lost souls appeared. Uh, puzzle. You ask the lost soul for help with a puzzle. He doesn't. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. I must capture a human. Just give it up. I did. Shit. Fuck. Then everyone will. Shit. Shit. Uh, J. 
joke. You told the lost soul a bad pun, the skeletons. You seem to hate it, but the other lost soul seems to like it. You'll never see him again. Shit. Crossword. You tell the lost soul you think that crosswords are tougher than jumble, and not to Ted like it knew the without the question. No, wait! You're my friend! I could never capture you! Nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. Let's save Toriel and Asgore. Within the depths of Asriel's soul, making something resonating. The lost soul. Let's hug. You hug the lost soul and tell her that you're going to see her again. Something about this so familiar to her. This is your own this is for your own good. Forgive me. Oh shit. God. Ah. Let's mercy. You refuse to fight the lost soul. Something about this is so familiar to her. No one will leave again. This is my duty. Let's... Let's... Let's mercy. You tell the lost soul that you won't hurt him, no matter what. Something about this is so familiar to him. Ah! Jesus! Let's hug. You hug the lost soul. Suddenly, his memories are flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. Let's save Alphys. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something resonating. Oh, she's still on her dress. Nerd out. You ask the lost soul what her favorite cartoon is. She can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. You hate me, don't you? Shit. Ah! Shit. Quiz. You ask the lost soul for help on a quiz question. She barely holds back from giving you an answer. Shit. Encourage. You tell the lost soul that you're continuing to support her. Suddenly, she remembers. It's all falling back. No, that's not true. My friends like you. My friends like me. And I like you too. Your friend's souls are resonating with the same. Someone else. Strangely, as your friends remember you, something else began resonating with the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that they still... There's still one last person in need of saving. But who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? What are you doing? Hey, it's me. It's Azrael. Aww. Aww. That's so cute. You feel your friend's soul resonating within Azrael. What? what did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No! No! I don't need anyone! Stop it! Get away from me! Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart! Tony, do you know why I'm doing this? Why, I'm keep, why I keep fighting to keep you around? It's like tutorials. I'm doing this because you're special, Tony. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. No, that's not just it. I, I, I'm doing this because I care about you, Tony. I care about you more than anybody else. I'm 
I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So please, stop doing this. And just let me win. Sorry, bro. Stop it. Oh my god. Stop it now! Tony. I'm so alone. Tony. I'm so afraid. Tony. Tony, I. I. This is getting really sad. I'm so sorry. No, don't cry, please. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Tony? I know. You're not actually Tony, are you? Tony's been gone for a long time. Um, what? What is your name? Frisk? That's a nice name. Oh. So, the human that died many years ago was me. And this person is named Frisk. Oh. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone else's, everyone's soul inside of me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monsters as well. They all care about each other so much. And they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone else felt about you. Pyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are weird, even though they barely know you. It feels like they are really lo they all really love you. <laughs> Frisk, I I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. I forgive you, buddy. Wh what? Frisk, come on. You're, you're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if I, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep those souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's heart beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire, with everyone's power, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. The barrier was destroyed. Wait, does that mean he's gonna turn back into a flower? I'm so cute. Frisk? I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's soul, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk. It's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go to the people who love you. I want to comfort him. Give me a hug, buddy. Oh. I'm not crying. What are you talking about? <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't want to let go. I'm glad I don't have a webcam. Frisk, you're you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. By the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? Mm, I hate crying. <laughs> Just, uh. Frisk. This is all just a bad dream. Please, wake up. Oh, wow. Oh, you are awake. Thank goodness. We we're all so worried. It felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer, I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Yeah, you made Papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry. I don't cry. I just caught something in my eye. What did you catch? Tears! <laughs> Look at his face. Oh my god. Now, now. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Here, Frisk. What? Not drink some tea. I'll make you feel better. Uh, how about we give them some space first? They must be very exhausted. Though, from what I am not certain. Frisk, we do not remember what exactly happened. There was a flower and then everything went white. But now the barrier is gone. When are you ready? We will... I'll return to the surface. It seems the door to the east will lead us right there. But before then, perhaps you might want to take a walk? You can say goodbye to all your wonderful friends. Do you wish we will do as you wish? We will all wait here for you. Oh my god, man. Wow. That was I gotta say, that's a great ending right there. I know it's not over yet, so... What I wanna do is... What I remember... I still have this snowman piece. So you know what that means. Let's go drop it back off to the flower. Or the... Not the flower. Let's go back to the snowman. And let's drop it back off to the snowman. I will be right back. So... I kinda exited out the game by accident. And I found this. This is heartwarming right here. So, without further ado, let's go to the snowman and let's give him the final piece. By the way, this is gonna take like a little bit because I'm pretty sure a lot of this is like, uh, here we go. Ah! I can feel that piece of me has been well taken care of. Hmm? The barrier's opened up? Hmm. Then, if it's not too much to ask, could you take that piece of me to the surface? I would really appreciate it. So all that time I could have just walked and just... Okay, whatever. Well, you know what? Since I'm all the way down here, I might as well just see what all the commotion is about. Because... When I was walking back, some of these characters were not here. Like, some of these, these were not here. So, I'm gonna go all the way back to Toriel's place. That's probably not open, by the way. But, I'm gonna just see, like, how far I can just do this. By the way, we're gonna just pretty much take a trip down memory lane. Wow, to think this is where it all started. <clears throat> this is where it all started, people. It started in Toriel's house. This is so heartwarming. 
Like, wow. Most of the pie is gone. There's still a dog prince on it. There's nothing in Toriel's room. Is that place still under re renovation? Yep. Still just you. Frisk. Not Tony anymore, Frisk. So, oh, it has a smile on it. That's cute. Never really saw that. <sighs> but yeah, literally nothing was back in here, just a few memories. This is so heartwarming. There was Flowey's little place right there. So I gotta say, I love Undertale because the, the story was phenomenal. I gotta say, like, everything brought together, it was foolish, it was stupid, it was... It was challenging, it was it was all it was pretty much everything you need in a game. Breaking the fourth wall, sands, he's breaking the fourth wall. Like pretty much Deadpool, it's awesome. Conveniently shaped lamps. Just a conveniently shaped lamp, yep, pretty much. Then at the end you can go back and see all the characters like these guys. Mom might have to might have to share her mind with other people now, but she'll she still has my mom, and that's cool, cause uh, we're made of ice and stuff. What? It's a joke. Laugh at it. <laughs> okay. The the Dutch the doctor. I don't know how I say that. She brought my wife back from the dead. My son. He seems happy again. Our, fi our family is big, bigger than ever. Now that my wife is combined with 16 other people. Oh, Jesus. I feel bad. It's a note from Papyrus. Seeing as this spaghetti is still here somehow, I hereby donate to the public. It's like a playground for your mouth. <laughs> Papyrus. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Oh, this little guy. Ha! After all this time, you're still thinking about my hat. Please? <laughs> I still think about your hat, don't worry. It's all of it. Oh yeah, the stupid puzzle. Aww. Oh, this girl, hello. We're all free? Okay, okay. I'll stop lowing around. Gonna that dog now. It probably doesn't... What? I don't I know what I said. Whoops. What's going on here? What was this? Oh, hey. I didn't see you down here before. I know how to set myself apart now. An ear piercing. Wait. <laughs> I don't even know what that meant. Whatever. Wee shit. Ah, crap. Alright. I'm still failing at that part for some reason. Why? Shit. Wow. Really? I did it again, didn't I? Seriously? Am I really gonna do this right now? There we go. Whee! Hat? Yeah. It's over here. Hey, it's that weird thing. Everyone's leaving, huh? Good riddance. Maybe I'll finally get some peace and quiet. Oh, that's bad. You're just mean. I, sh I really didn't know what was in this cave, though. The door. You can open the door. I still don't know what this is. Like, what's what's the point of that cave? There's literally nothing in it. I don't even. Am I supposed to find a key or something? I don't know how it works. Maybe someone on the surface will pay attention to me. There's so many people. Someone has to, right? Yeah, of course. I mean, you're a little snowman with a spiky head. Of course, someone's gonna notice you. some time. Hello, bunny thing. Uh, is anyone else weirded out that those giant stumbling... What? Hey, Monster K, what's up? Yo, what's up? I've been kind of doing some thinking. Maybe Undyne isn't actually as cool as we thought. She's just kind of mean. But yo, I just found out what... About another way cooler. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it was a papyrus. <laughs> Grillbees! 
Wow, it's dead. In the end, I never caught any girls in my fishing line. So kid, take it from me. Don't try to catch hot people with a fishing rod. Somewhere you hear a whisper of dismay. Wow, a brand new world? I might not get to translate for might not get to translate for grill bees anymore. Which is fine, since I was actually just making up what he was saying. It's finally won a game of poker against itself? <laughs> what? Hey, people won't have to move in from the city anymore. Seems like we won't have to lo lose our local culture, except we're all moving out of here, huh? Oh well, guess it can't be all punk peaches and punk what? I don't know what it said. Hey. I wonder if the overall overworld has hot guys. Uh, okay. Soon, I'll be able to try some human food. And then I'll guess how to try- Okay. No. Just no. Hey, you guys never talked. What about this guy who was throwing stuff? Ice Wolf no longer has to throw ice. Ice Wolf can make a break to buy some pants now. Okay. Tra la la, care if I ride? I'm gonna miss you the most. Let's go to the waterfall. And we're off. I'm gonna miss this guy in his cat running boat. Tra la la. Oh, oh suddenly, feeling tropical. I'm always like wondering what's like this guy's problem, like what is with him. Never really understood. There he is. Oh, Metaton. I'm a huge fan. Oh, hi, human. I'll never forget when you cheered me on when I was pretending to sleep. No one had ever had so much faith in my fake sleep. Oh, also, this is oh awkward but what's your name everyone seems to know it now except me seems like i've been missing out lately i was just sitting on my home at my home listening to tunes there was a flash of light outside my window i saw the snails on the farm disappear and then i heard a knock at the door the flash of the light wanted to come in now everyone knows your name except for me frisk oh i won't forget it There you are, Frisk Darling! Feast your eyes! Dr. Alphys completed my wonderful new body! Oh, and did you hear? The barrier's open! I can't wait to see the sun! The greatest spotlight of all! Oh yes, I suppose I should thank you too, darling! Before fighting you, I had forgotten how fun it was to perform with others! So I've been searching for hot talents to fill up my upcoming troop. So far, Shrieken, Shrien agreed to be back, be my backup singer. And Bill Napsa Block here will be my sound mixer. And three of us perform together. It really feels overdue, doesn't it? A little bit, yeah. I still want to know what that is. Timmy! Whoa, ten years news! Very good! Whoa, ten years news! Very good! Alright, what does Bob have to say? I'm pleasing this um, development, no? Wow. Whoa, if Thames can go on surface, can see lots of cute humans! Hunans! Everyone's go free! But Tim! Tem not leave! Tem watch egg! Tem will be happy fam- <laughs> Oh my god. Hoives! Statue of Tem. Very famous. Very. <laughs> hey. Yeah? Who are you? Freedom? What? Bah! You're pulling my leg. If you have legs. It's a box. Presumably to be pushed. Welcome to Hotland. Uh, 
I'll be able to have a nice drink on the surface of the shell. And the lab. Can we turn this off? That's annoying. I don't like how I keep getting spied on. Ah, the cooking. Oh, that was great. It's close to the table. Hit <laughs> some tapping. And then told us that Royal Guards is being disbanded, like bummer. Hmm. Well, I guess it's time. Oh, they're all opened. The coffin is empty. You didn't notice before, but there's something like mummy wrappings at the bottom of it. Oh, that's creepy. The only thing left to do is talk to everybody. Hello, Frisk. Alphys upgraded my phone. I'm having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Sans, check out this one. Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the queen has returned. And also that she's a huge dork. You two are... You two are two feet away from each other. Why are you texting? Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for good reason. Why is this set? Why is that? Well, because we're huge dorks. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of, of a bonehead. Haha, <laughs> wow. Those puns are even less funny coming from her. Then why are you smiling? It's a pity smile. <laughs> hey, Frisk. What's with the weird expression? Sans, did I tell you about the time Frisk flirted with me? Oh my god, no! No! Why don't bring that up? No! Don't bring that up! And then ask me and ask to call me my <laughs> I can't believe she remembers that! Oh boy. Wow, Frisk. This really puts our relationship in a new light. Hey, Tori. Did you have any other embarrassing stories? Oh, did I ever? But I think that story is one of the most unbelievable. It is hard to think anyone would want to flirt with me. Heh. <laughs> uh, Toriel. You have no idea. Oh my god, Jesus. So, Asgore. How about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, uh, Papyrus. Now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal Guard anymore. What? Then what's the point of the human quest? They journeyed all that way, and I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard. Truly, this is the worst possible ending. So, Alphys, what do you want to do now that we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. But, well... Of course, I'm going to go out and, uh, no, I should be honest. I'm gonna stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. That's the spirit! Everyone, a celebration to being losers. <laughs> Papyrus has the right idea. Losing to Frisk is the best thing that ever happened to me. So I'm glad that we, uh, what is it, Asgore? Um, what's an anime? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my god! Frisk, please, help me explain what anime is as to Asgore. You see, it's like a cartoon, but... With swords! So, it's like a cartoon with swords. Golly, that sounds neato. Where is this? Where can I see that anime? Hold on, uh, I think I have some in my phone. Here, look at this. Oh, uh, um, that's the, that's the wrong, uh, never mind. Golly, were those two robots kissing? Boy, technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it sure is. 
Alphys, do you have some kinky shit in your phone that uh, we're not supposed to see? <laughs> Two robots kissing. Oh boy, Alphys, you are really something, isn't it? Psst, Frisk, um, you, you gotta tell me. Did, do you think Asgore and Toyo are, uh, ever gonna get back together? Uh, I really have no clue. Judging how much Toriel hates him right now, I don't think so, so I'm, a, I'm about to say no. Yeah, that's what I thought. A woman can dream though, right? I had read fanfictions. A lot of fanfictions! Jesus Christ. Howdy, Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about that. Hope we can still be pals. Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everyone's tried to kill Fr Frisk at least once. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. Asgore, that's not what I meant. Well, I guess that's it. Let's say one last goodbye. Let's actually go to the end, literally. This is the end of the Let's Play, guys. At least for now. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out of the underground. I'm ready. Oh wow. Oh my! Isn't it beautiful? Everyone? Wow! It's even better than I- on TV! Way better! Better than I ever imagined! Frisk, you'll live with this! The sunlight is so nice! And the air is so fresh! I really feel alive! Hey, Sans! What's that giant ball? We call it the sun, my friend! That's the sun? Wowee! I can't believe I'm finally meeting the sun! I could stand here and watch this for hours. Yes, it is beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Oh, right. Everyone, this is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. Frisk. I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? Yes. Yay! Frisk will be the best ambassador. And I, the Great Papyrus, will be the best mascot. I'll go make the good first impression. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, someone gotta keep him from getting into trouble. See you guys. <laughs> You're going the opposite way. <laughs> Say it's where are you going? Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait! Hey, Undyne, wait up! This is, uh, that's awkward. Whoops. Uh, should I do something? <laughs> um, well, gotta go. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah, I don't think they're gonna get back together. It seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk, you came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? I want to stay here. What? Frisk, you really are a funny child. If you, had, if you had said that earlier, none of this would have ever happened. It is a good thing you took so long to change your mind. <laughs> well, I suppose if you really do not have any other place to go, I will do my best to take care of you for as long as you need me. Alright? Now, come along. Everyone is waiting for us. Aww. That's so beautiful. Poor Flowey, though. Best game ever.
Oh my god, I love this game so much! Froggit wins them. Oh my god, this music. By Temmie. Oh my god, yes. Snaps the block by Toby. Spooky DJ. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> go, little bird, go! <laughs> Sans! Pop Papyrus. Poor Papyrus. At least he has to drive in a car. Oh, man. Snow Drake. Ice Cap. Semi successful comedian thinking about his hat. Griffots, gr Griff Trot, Gift Trot, Finding Peace and Quiet, Doggo, Has His Own Seeing Eye Dog. Aww. By Toby? Finally, number one knows Nuzzle Champions. Lesser Dog, Found a Loving Owner, Greater Dog, Excited by Life's Change. Oh, that's so cool. Oh. oh, please, please do it! Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, yes! I've been waiting for that for so long. Aaron, still flexing. Tammy, Tammy. Legendary Janitor. <laughs> Mad Dummy. Calm down just a bit. <gasps> yes! Oh my! I see Temmie. Metaton! Oh wow, you were right. Special Inspiration. Oh, he has legs now! Nice. Oh, this music! Woo! Encouraging space heater. Finally confessing. What the- What? I don't. Candle in the world's largest cupcake. Birthday cake. Spider success with the new bakery. Oh, that's nice. Royal guards. Use their imagina- Use your imagination. Ew. I'm good. Searching for life's meaning. Frightened- Fighting for future, for the future. Night night. Taking a well-deserved nap. Street magic. Living with their families. Oh, that's good. Asgore! Is that Papyrus? Monster Kid. Aww. Oh, she's a teacher now. Well, that's cool. That's cool. What? <laughs> oh my god, you've got to be kidding me. Did you really think it was over? What? I mean, we haven't even done the special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end it all. This for good. Oh my god, that's so cool. Oh, the music, yes. That is awesome. What? I can't... No! Am I supposed to hit all of these? I don't understand. Oh 
Oh my god, this is so trippy. My head! I don't know how I didn't hit any of that, whatever. Oh, that so hurts my head. That hurts my head so much. Oh my god. Oh, how are you supposed to dodge this? Ah! Shit. Ah, no! No! Stop! No! Yeah, I can do these. Dodge it! Fuck! No! Dodge it all! Ah! No! No! I'm out of rhythm! No! Ah! Oh my god, I'm so terrible. Awesome. Touched credits. Oh man. Thanks to friends and families for supporting us. And under under tail teams, thanks. You the player from the bottom of our hearts, without you all this would be possible. Good night. Oh man, that was so the heart disappeared there. That was awesome. Oh, what? Aww. <laughs> Aww. That was awesome. Oh man, the end. Wow, that was a good ending. I gotta say, this game is 100% my favorite game of all time right now. So if I just press Z, does it end? Nope, it just stays there. So... I want to thank you guys so much for joining me on Undertale. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like for this video and comment down below. What was your favorite moment in Undertale? What? Um. Hello, doggy. Um. The, the dog. What are you doing? Uh. Doggy? Dog? You gonna... Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. And share with your friends. And I will see you guys in the genocide route. Bye-bye! <laughs>